All right, I have my field sweater swatch here that I'm working the grain stitches. I've just completed round four. I'm going to work round five now. I have a couple of edge stitches here on my piece. I'm just going to knit first before I get to my pattern repeats. So I'm gonna be working on repeats of five stitches here. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a yarn over. So I've just done that, wrap that around my right needle. Next up, I want to knit my first stitch. Now I'm going to make grain. So we're going to go into our stitch, knit, pull the new loop that we've just made out. I like to separate my needles a bit to stretch out these loops, make my grain a little bit bigger, and then do a double yarn over. Go back into that stitch on my left needle and knit it and now take it off of my needle. So I should have in my grain stitch, one, two, three, four loops because I have a double yarn over. Next stitch here, I'm going to slip purlwise. The yarn's in the back. I'm going to make a grain again. So into my stitch, knit, leave the stitch on my left needle, pull the new one out on my right needle double yarn over on the right needle, go back into the stitch on the left needle, knit it, pull it off the needle. New grain stitch of one, two, three, four loops. And then knit the last stitch. Oops. I'm gonna slip my stitch marker repeat that process again. So first stitch will be a yarn over. And just make sure it stays on the other side of your stitch marker there. We're going to knit, make our grain stitch. So in, knit, pull out the right loop, double yarn over on the right needle, go back into that stitch still on your left needle, knit it one more time. Next stitch, I'm going to slip purlwise, make grain. And knit. Slip my stitch marker. Yarn over. Knit. Make grain. Into my stitch, knit. Leave it on the left needle, pull the new loop out on the right needle, double yarn over, one, two, knit that stitch again. Slip, make grain, and knit. I'm going to work the rest of that repeat here to the end of my swatch. And then you'll be moving on to round six. We're just going to be knitting, knitting through the back loop and slipping our grains purlwise as we've done before, such as in round two.